Hello, my name is Jamo from a company called Xcase in the UK. You can find us at www.xcase.co.uk. We're an importer of rack mount computer chassis, related parts, PC cases, and we also build up server systems. Today I wanted to look at a, a 2U system build that we do in our rack mount chassis RM208 Pro. The 208 Pro has eight hot swap bays. Now this is a 2U chassis, 650mm deep, and it will take anything from ITX up to extended ATX motherboards, as well as the 8 hot swap caddy. There's an option for a slim optical. We've got power, reset, two USBs, and activity lights for LAN and in internal hard drive. You can fit two internal 2.5 inch uh, drives internally, SSDs, etc. And just going back to the caddies, just got one drive in this particular caddy here. And you'll see that there's a blue power light. When you get drive activity, there's also a green LED, which will just flicker away. Caddies themselves will take two and a half inch and three and a half inch SATA and SAS drives. Now this system is currently running and although or not it's though it's not silent, it's not noisy. And we get a demand for uh, rack mount server systems that don't scream along like jet engines. This is done by these three temperature controlled fans which are connected through the back plane then to the motherboard on three separate pin headers. So if you check in the system's IPMI you'll be able to see each fan individually. So if, for instance, a fan fails, I'll just do a quick demo. Then this will get detected and the other fans will speed up to increase cooling. The same would happen if the fan on the CPU cooler stopped working as well. The front hot swap drives are connected to this back plane. It's a mini SAS back plane. So it has two uh, SAS connection ports, 8087 ports, and these connect directly either to a RAID or HBA card, or you can connect them to your motherboard SATAs using a reverse breakout cable, or as in this particular build, which is a Supermicro X10 SRH CL. F. It's got two mini SAS ports on the uh, motherboard and so these can connect with just two cables directly to the back plane and that's a 12 gig connection LSI 3008. This particular board also takes a standard Xeon E5 2600 version 3 
and it's got eight dim slots and plenty of expansion ports. This particular system is fitted with a redundant power supply. We use redundant power supplies from AS Power, platinum rated, and the advantage of a redundant power supply, I'll just demonstrate. So you've got two power leads going into two single modules. If one is removed or fails, then you'll get a warning, which you can turn off with a switch at the back. And the system will just continue quite happily until you remove the module, which is hot swappable, and replace it. So if I just put that back, just as it was before. The chassis itself is 650mm deep, we provide a rack mount rail kit for it and if you're doing a build yourself in this particular chassis it will take anything from ITX up to extended ATX motherboards. Really is a nice chassis this, nice to build with and nice for a customer buying a server system. So there we have it, a service system build in the XCase RM208 Pro. Thanks for listening.